given three variables x, y, z write a function to circularly shift their values to right. In order words if x equals 5, y equals 8, z equals 10, after circular shift y equals 5, z equals 8, x equals 10. Call the function with variables a, b, c to circularly shift values. Firstly, we have to create new file L question number 14. So, we will do this uh, question in two form in, uh, in, with the help of two methods. Uh, first would be uh, calling function, and second, uh, we will run multiple values in main function through another function so let's create first pre preprocessor uh, here actually we are using only swapping method so we don't need math library here so let's create our function let's assume it safe and we will accept three variable x sorry sorry let's have a look on question so we have to give three variable x y and z so and then call the function with variable a b c so let's take variable a b And let's create our main function okay so here we have to take three variable x comma y comma z okay let's accept the value from z enter x and tab x we are not going to write it again so let's copy it y y z z so it will accept all the three values now we simply call the function ok so save and it will accept x comma y comma z now perform our main functionality for shift function so let's save int shift ok int a So we have to perform swapping here. So in circular manner, manner. So we are taking a new variable called ten. So it will help us to swap easily. So in circular manner, we have to provide last variable which is c to ten, and then we assign c is equal to b and then b is equal to a and a is equal to 10 so it will swap the values and let's print the values a so x will be x and, and, and y will be 
and Z. Okay, here B, A, B, C. That's fine. Okay, let's check. Let's test it. Compile it in the test. So we are passing the value five. Let me check in question five eight z eight and ten so, so according to the question y will be five z will be eight and x will be ten so it's working fine let's take second example so here what we are going to do is we will use uh, multiple returning function so we have to use pointer here so we need to do is we have to print star here to make these value out as pointer and then We simply shift. Okay, it will accept the address of it. X Y Z. Okay. Now we have to print the result here within the main function. So here. Let's copy this statement from here. We are not going to write it again and again. Okay. okay. And uh, here will be x, y, and z. Okay, so let's write a function also here so we can easily determine what was the value before and after so before shift and uh, these will be after shift let's remove x from like e tab will be fine here so nice let's create okay fine so i think it should work okay now let's move to the our actual function so here we have to assign it pointer 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 and uh, here we also assign c pointer 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 here every value will be treated as pointer so it's okay let's test let's compile it okay error what is there here sorry okay so value will be part 10 okay first we check this we change the structure let's do it 5, 8, and 10. Okay. So, according to the question, x, 5, 8, 10, and y will be 5, z will be 8, and x. Okay, it's fine. So, this is the second method. So, it's returning good. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.